वेलकम टू बिट फ्यूम्स आई एम योर होस्ट सार्थक एंड यू हैव प्रॉबेबली यूज्ड दिस काइंड ऑफ वेबसाइट्स वेयर यू कैन प्रोवाइड अ लिंक एंड दे विल प्रोवाइड यू द शॉर्ट एंड लिंक simply called url shortener so we have two very popular website for url shortener which is one is bitly.com and here you can see we have this bitfilms.com website link is now shortened by this url so if you copy and paste it here it will redirect me to the website similarly we also have the goo.gl website so here you can see i have many links and i have just shortened that here also let's copy that and paste it here it's now redirecting me to that udemy course yeah obviously with coupon also <laughs> okay so you can see we have these cool things and it just increase your count so if i refresh this page you can see now the count is increased to 18 so we can know how many times our link is clicked not only that if you go here you can see the location is there and on this part you can probably see the analytics and it is very nice it just give you whole bunch of information about the user who has clicked on this shortened link so why not create the same thing with laravel so i have created this url hyphen shortener.bitfilms.com actually if you go to this website you will land on this page and let's click on url shortener and i'm going to provide a link to let's say to bitfilms.com slash blog here let's grab any one blog so let's grab this one so this has long long uh, url and i'm going to just paste it here and shorten link in here and obviously because the original website where you are hosting this has to be very short name so like this bitly.com then gwo.gl so in that way your url is shortened but the basic point is that you just have a six character random word which is just going to be shortened so you can see the url shortened here is actually this so if i copy this link and paste it here you can probably see that the actual url is now shortened with this word having random characters and numbers and i have just given this r just for sake of clarity that it's going to be a url shortener thing so if i go and click here and you can see click is no open graph data is nothing but as soon as i land on this page that means i have clicked there refresh and yes the click is one and we have the open graph detail what is open graph detail if you ever open any website inspect the source you can see og data are there so og is stands for open graph which is very famous for facebook users so if you have ever shared any facebook link then facebook uses the open graph so we are going to grab the open graph data of the link the original link so if i go to the open graph detail yeah i have this uh, uh, image then description title short and url and original url and the most important and exciting part is the number of clicks so if i now go and see you can probably have the location country name then region city and the exact ip address so if i go here and i will say my ip address let's check the my ip address and here on this website you can see that this is the exact ip address which is now tracked by this url shortener so it is very useful and why not create this on our own so this series is going to be very basic and advanced also how these two are going to combine because i'm going to create this project with the use of test driven development that means tdd we will write the test and then create the things test will tell us what we need to do then if you are beginner you don't worry about that if you don't know how to test even don't worry about that because i'm going to start this series with a very very low pace i'm going to explain each and everything so that if you don't know or if you have any kind of fear 
on writing a test you will going to love the test and i will going to explain you what will be the benefit of the test when we complete this project so i am very excited to have this project on your uh, project list and this will also enhance your test driven knowledge and obviously you can see i have already created a github page so if you go to my web, uh, github page of slash bitroom slash url shortener you can have all the codes whatever we do on our project later then i will commit that here and you will have the all source code so this is the project and obviously the project exact here so let's start from the next episode and if you have liked this episode and you want to follow me on this episode want to learn this how to how to create this project just go and subscribe to this channel if you have not already done that and don't forget to hit the bell icon to get instant notification you can also follow me on facebook twitter and instagram at bitfumes and obviously if you can share this videos with your friend that will be the great thing because sharing is caring so we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye